The following information is provided for educational purposes only and in no way constitutes legal, tax, or financial advice. For legal, tax, or financial advice specific to your business needs, we encourage you to consult with a licensed attorney and or CPA in your state. The following information is copyright protected. No part may be redistributed, copied, modified, or adapted without prior written consent of the author. In this video, we are going to teach you how to research and choose your desired LLC name. The purpose of this video is to help you avoid infringing upon someone else's name rights, to help you differentiate your business name from existing entities, and to make sure your desired LLC name is available for use. In order to make sure your desired LLC name is available for use, you will need to search it against the existing organized entities on the state's online database. We will first walk you through some requirements and restrictions, and then later we will show you how to perform your search. Name Requirements Your LLC name must end with the words Limited Liability Company or the abbreviations L.L.C. or LLC. Using the abbreviation LLC is the most common. For example, Joe wants to start a company by the name Joe's Landscaping Services. Since he is forming an LLC, he must file under the name Joe's Landscaping Services LLC. Again, using the abbreviation LLC or the full word Limited Liability Company is a requirement when forming an LLC. Name Restrictions Your LLC name cannot imply that it is a corporation. You are not allowed to use the words corporation or incorporated or the abbreviations corp or inc anywhere in your LLC name. Let's look at our example again. Since Joe wants to form an LLC, he cannot call his company Joe's Landscaping Services Inc. LLC or Joe's Landscaping Services Incorporated LLC. Your desired LLC name must also be distinguishable. This means it cannot be too similar to the names of existing organized entities that are found in the results during the search of the database. We will now illustrate several examples of distinguishability and we will provide examples you may see while performing your search. Differences in designators, which are the identifiers at the end of a business name, do not create distinguishability. Examples of designators would be Inc. or Corp. for corporations and LLC or L.L.C. for limited liability companies. There are other designators as well, but these are the most commonly used. For example, your desired LLC name is Smith Investments LLC, but during the search of the database, let's say you found the business under the name Smith Investments Inc. In this example, your desired LLC name would not be available for use. You would have to think of an alternative name that is unique and different. An example would be Smith Financial Group LLC. Grammatical differences. The following do not create distinguishability. Differences in variables in singular, plural, and possessive forms of a word. For example, your desired LLC name is Apple Farm LLC. Let's just say during the search you found the business under the name Apple Farms LLC, or let's say you also found the business under Apple's Farm LLC with an apostrophe S. Both of these names, although slightly different, are too similar, and therefore your desired LLC name would not be available for use. An example of an alternative name would be Bob's Apple Orchard LLC. The following do not create distinguishability. Differences in articles, such as a, an, or the. For example, your desired LLC name is Print Shop LLC. Let's just say that during the search of the database, you found a business called The Print Shop LLC, or you found a business called A Print Shop LLC. Again, although they seem different, these names are all the same in the eyes of the state, and therefore your desired LLC name would not be available for use. An alternative name would be Printing Solutions LLC. The following also do not create distinguishability. The use of conjunctions, such as and, or, and the ampersand symbol. Let's say your desired LLC name is Night and Day LLC with the ampersand symbol. But during your search, you find a Night and Day LLC or you found a Night Day LLC. Again, both of these examples are too similar and your desired LLC name is not distinguishable and therefore not available for use. An example of an alternative name 
would be Moon and Sunshine LLC. The following also do not create distinguishability. The use of certain punctuation, such as hyphens, slashes, periods, commas, etc. Let's say your desired LLC name is Peter, Paul, and Mary Studios LLC, but during your search you found Peter Paul Mary Studios Incorporated, or you found a Peter, comma, Paul, comma, and Mary Studios Incorporated. Again, both of these examples are too similar, and therefore your desired LLC name would not be available for use. An alternative example would be PPM Productions LLC. Alphanumeric. Differences in numerical or written numbers does not create distinguishability. For example, let's say your desired LLC name is 3 Teachers Consulting LLC with the number 3 spelled out, but during your search of the database you found a company called 3 Teachers Consulting LLC with the number 3. Again, these are deceptively similar. The state does not look at these as any different and therefore your desired LLC name would not be available for use. An alternative example would be a few good teachers consulting LLC. Deceptively similar. Names that are too similar to existing organized entities also do not create distinguishability. For example, your desired LLC name is Speedy Delivery Services LLC, but during your search, let's say you find a Speed Delivery Services LLC or you find a Super Speedy Delivery Services LLC. Again, these names are too similar, therefore your desired LLC name would not be available for use. An example of an alternative name would be At Your Door Quick, LLC. Takeaways. As you can see, just filing your paperwork with your desired LLC name is not as straightforward as you may have originally thought. The most important takeaways from showing you all these examples are as follows. It's important to make sure your name is truly unique and not too similar to the names of existing organized entities. If your desired LLC name is unavailable for use, either by its exact match already being used or by it being too similar to an existing name, we recommend using some creativity and coming up with a variation of your original LLC name so that the name is now unique and is distinguishable and stands apart from other businesses. Some additional tips to think of when creating your LLC name are make your LLC name easy to spell. You want to make sure people can find you when they're looking for you. Make your LLC name short. Shorter names are easier for people to remember. Make your LLC name have a positive connotation. Leave people with a good feeling when they hear about your business. You are now ready to search your desired LLC name against the state's online database. We showed you a number of examples where the desired LLC names were not available for use, but don't worry. In the next part of this video, we will provide plenty of examples of names that are available for use so that you can best understand the database and the results that you see. Let's head over to the state's online database. The link below this video will take you there. Here we are on the state's website. Again, the link below the video will take you here. Under Division, where it says Corporations, that's fine. Uh, this searches all entities, corporations, LLCs, etc. For some reason, the state just refers to everything as corporations. Under Search Type, the default name starting with is fine. Before we begin our searches, there's a few things I want to mention to you regarding the North Carolina database. Companies in the North Carolina database will show various statuses when doing your search, which will help you determine your LLC's name availability. There are multiple statuses in the database, including the following administratively dissolved, auto dissolved, converted, current dash active, dissolved, merged, multiple, reserved name, revoked, suspended, and withdrawn. The good news is that you don't have to memorize this list. If your desired name comes up with any of these statuses, it is not available for use. Don't worry. These will make more sense in a moment when we show you how to search the database. When searching, enter your desired LLC name without the designator LLC or L.L.C. Capitalization is not important, so you can search your name in all lowercase or all uppercase or any variation. Let's search the online database now to show you how this works. It may be easier to watch us perform the name search the first time, then you can revisit this part of the video when you do your own search. 
Let's first look at some examples of names that are available. Let's say your desired LLC name is Duke Devils LLC. Let's head over to the database and let's first search it broadly via just the word Duke and then after that we'll search Duke Devil. Let's head over to the database. Again leave the drop downs in their default setting and let's enter Duke into the name field and click search. What this does is it brings up all entities in the database that start with the word Duke. All right, let's scroll through this list and see if we see anything similar to Duke Devil or Duke Devils. You'll see the list is in alphabetical order. We have Duke and then words that begin with A, B, C, and let's get down to D. So we have Duke Denmark, Duke Development, Duke, Duke Development again, Duke DFC. Okay, nothing that looks like Duke Devil or Duke Devils. This is a good sign. And now let's just double check that and let's do a more refined search. Let's go back up to the top and click the search again button. And in the name box, I'm going to enter Duke Devil. And then I'm going to click search. Okay, no results found for Duke Devil. Again, this is a good sign. Since we found no existing names under Duke Devil, and when we searched Duke, we didn't even find anything similar, that means that this desired LLC name would be available for use. Let's look at another example. Let's say that your desired LLC name is Peer Beers LLC. Let's go over to the database and let's search Peer and then let's search Peer Beers. I'm going to click search again and I'm going to enter Peer into the name box and click search. Again, the list is in alphabetical order. Peer 12, 16, Peer 1. So we have the numbers coming first. And then let's scroll down a little bit more. Okay, Peer 9, Peer Cool, Peer Auto. Peer and Company, or Pierce, excuse me. Okay, it would actually fall, if it were in this list, it would fall Peer, somewhere between the C and the Peer Auto and Pierce and Company. Let's just take another look down just to double check. All right, this is a good sign. Now let's go ahead and let's hit search again just to double check. Let's enter Peer Beers and click search. Oh, no results found. Ah, good sign. Again, because we didn't find any existing companies that were similar or identical to Peer or Peer Beers, that means the desired LLC name is available for use. Let's look at a few examples of names that are unavailable. Let's say the desired LLC name is Tech Tools LLC. Let's go and search the database for Tech and then Tech Tool. Let's go ahead and hit search again. Let's enter Tech and click search. All right, we're under Tech Tools. This is the numbers, A, B, C. Actually, I'm going to go all the way down. Uh, this is quite a long list. All right, so I'm on the I's, and we still haven't gotten there. You'll see here I'm going to click Next Page at the bottom. I, K. This is a pretty long list, actually. Let's go down, Tech Marketing, N. Okay, I think we have to go to the next page. Okay, yeah, that's T-E-C-N. D-E-C-H-N, excuse me. Uh, all right, I'm going to click next page again. <laughs> and let's get down to the T's. So sometimes, depending on your desired LLC name, <laughs> there may be four names that show up or you know, 400. So uh, do take your time and, and take a look through the list, making sure that uh, there's nothing similar to your desired LLC name. So we're looking for the T, right? Tech Nicole. Is that... Let's see, we've got to go down further. We're still on T-E-C-H-N. I think we have to go one more page. Wow. Anyway, so if, you know what, uh, this is a great example to actually segue into the other search here. So let's say that your list just is so long when you do a broad search. Let's go ahead and hit search again. And in this example, I'm going to do tech tool and then click search. Ah, much better. So uh, unfortunately, in this case, we have an entity Tech-Tool Incorporated. This is a business corporation and it's currently active. Although that this name is hyphenated and it's a corporation, it is too similar to a desired LLC name. Again, because we found Tech-Tool Inc., our desired LLC name is not available because there's an existing corporation. Let's look at another example. Let's say the desired LLC name is Tomahawk Equities LLC. Let's go and search the database for the word Tomahawk going to go up here and click search again. Let's enter Tomahawk 
and click search. All right, and let's scroll down. And you can see in this case, we don't have to scroll pretty far because we have Tomahawk equities right here, two LLCs, and this one here, which doesn't have a Secretary of State ID number. You can see that that's just a reserved name. And the actual entity is right here, Tomahawk Equities LLC. This is a limited liability company that we found in the database. And although it does say administratively dissolved, we recommend avoiding these names because they can oftentimes cause conflict. In this case, because we found Tomahawk Equities LLC, our desired LLC name would not be available for use because there's an identical business name in the database and it's been administratively dissolved. You want to search your desired LLC name every way that you can think of to make sure it is truly unique and distinguishable. The good news is that you can search as many names and variations as you like, and it will cost you nothing. This is an important step in forming your LLC, so take the time to ensure that your name is unique and that it does not conflict with existing businesses. If you have any questions about the database, you can call the state at the phone number below this video. Once you find a name that is unique and distinguishable from existing businesses, you can then proceed to the next step. This now concludes the name research lesson.